I'm going to show you CBMC SSM, an extension of CBMC for bounded model checking of C programs using symbolic shadow memory. Shadow memory is useful for implementing program analysis as it allows to associate data inferred during the analysis with the memory locations of the analyzed program. CBMC SSM is intended to be used by developers of analysis for C programs. It enables rapid development of efficient program analysis by providing a shadow memory API that separates the specification of a program analysis from the details of a highly efficient verification backend. Users are required to follow the methodology of implementing a program analysis by an automated source level code instrumentation, which makes use of the shadow memory API provided by CPMC SSM. A typical flow starts from an input program, an automated instrumentation that contains calls to the shadow memory API is applied to that input program. The instrumented program is then passed to CBMC SSM to compute the analysis results. We performed several validation studies. I'm going to demonstrate the tool on a simple taint analysis example. We have also implemented a race detection tool for which I'm going to report results and we have started implementing a range abstraction and a weak memory model verifier based on sequentialization. To illustrate the use of our shadow memory API, I have manually instrumented a simple program to perform a taint analysis. The core of the program is this encode function that packs a username and a password into a JSON formatted string. The username and the password are non-deterministically constructed using this helper function down here. Then the encoding is performed and finally we check a property. I have manually instrumented this program to perform a taint analysis using our shadow memory API. First, I declare a shadow field, tainted, which is a Boolean flag initialized to zero. We leave the username untainted, whereas we set the flag to one to signal that the password is tainted. The property checks that only the password portion of the JSON format string is tainted and none of the other parts of the JSON string have been infected. I also inserted calls to propagate the taint correctly. These instrumentations would typically be performed by an automatic code instrumentation. I'm going to run this with CBMC SSM now using this command. And we see that the property is uh, correctly verified. So we can make the property fail by, for example, saying that also the username is tainted initially. So running this through CBMC again, this now tells us that the property is failing as expected. We have also implemented a data race detection tool using CBMC SSM. The implementation of the tool is just 600 lines within the lazy CSEC instrumentation framework, which shows that a fairly complex analysis can be implemented rapidly. We evaluated our data race detector on the SV con uh, concurrency benchmarks, demonstrating that it is almost up to par with dedicated and established tools like Thread Sanitizer or Poor SE. The benchmarks and full results of this evaluation are available for reproduction in our artifact, which you can download from this URL.